Welcome to all our sis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and some color. You Tauruses. All right. So Tauruses, what is happening? What is Jim's learning? Um, in business and career. Um, remember this is a time when it's reading. There's also an extended. And with this extended, you can use the join button. It's a dollar nine nine per month. And you can receive the extended. All right, Tauruses, let's get in your reading. So we see you coming in with the energy of the Empress. So you women and business people, this month is going to be ending up in some sort of a transition for you business people, okay? So uh, business people and manager, this month is going to be um, affecting you business people and management okay so a wonderful alignment of energy starting a period with the energy of the empress is a, a very wonderful if you recognize what is the energy of the empress the energy of the empress has to do with fertility a whole lot of money creating a whole lot of money for yourself it's about prosperity and it's about creativity so fertility here is when a project that you're working on is becoming um, very, is creating a whole lot of wealth for you, your business. So whenever you see the energy of the Empress um, showing up in the month as your first energy and upright, your business is going to be doing very, very good. Your creative juice is going to be flowing and it is going to be um, very positive. Now, this is about leadership. So this is what I said, managers and uh, um, anyone in management, uh, it is going to be good for you. Some of you could be receiving some sort of a promotion. Some of you are going to be getting some sort of a management role that is going to be happening. Okay. Um, let's look at the cross. Oopsie daisy. What is happening in the cross? Your enemies are, are down. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, your enemies are down. If you recognize in the middle of the cross, so what we're seeing is that we have the enemies in the reverse. So the energy is secrets. Your enemies, secrets about a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man is coming out. And I see that management is going to be coming down on this man. They have now recognized what this man was doing and how this man have created a whole lot of issue. A lot of you are dealing with a cancer man. A lot of you could be dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion. Now, what I need to advise you people is that a whole lot of situation, if you're a manager or you're a business person, a whole lot of situation is transpiring. If you notice, you have only major arcana and at the end of the month, it's not a month of uh, happiness and joy. The Ace of the Cups is in reverse. Management, a whole lot of problems with management is going to be transpiring. A whole lot of you business people are going to be standing your grounds. Um, and as you recognize in this cross, secrets, um, some of you are going to be finding out that a cancer was your greatest enemy. They're coming down on this cancer. Some of you are going to be finding out that a Pisces cancer or scorpion was your greatest enemy. So the energy of the moon is about information is coming out. Okay. This information that is coming out, um, is going to be affecting a lot of you. The moon is about secrecy and illusions that was created by a Pisces cancer or scorpion man. It is about the Pisces, the watery energy, um, the intuition, um, 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 and it is about um, you guys recognizing that there was some secrecy and a Pisces cancer or scorpion man had some sort of a secrecy. And what is transpiring is that uh, a Gemini man found out uh, what this Pisces and cancer man was doing and how this Pisces and cancer man was Coroxing some sort of a situation. And I see, um, management, higher uh, people in higher position is going to be coming down, um, on this person because they recognize what this person have done. So uh, when we look at uh, the King of Swords, the King of Swords uh, is someone who is from higher, um, position that is going to be bringing down, 
um, the swords on you guys, okay? This person is an Aquarian, so it could be some sort of a, a lawyer, legality, someone who is in a higher promotion or a higher position because this person is coming in and they are coming in very, very powerful um, because this air sign is about someone who would hire intellectual. So this could be lawyers or top end of manager. The last person, the CEO of a company is going to be coming down on a Pisces cancer or scorpion man because they recognize what this man have done and how this man have created a whole lot of problems and issue. So it's about the command in the rooms and taking down some sort of unfair situation that a manager was doing or a shareholder or um, um, a boss or a supervisor. And a lot of you, Taurus, this is going to be recognizing the secrecy of this man and what this man was doing. The energy of Gemini is in the... Um, um, is in the first week and energy of uh, um, this Gemini man is going to be recognizing the false play. Okay. The magician, it's about using the power, um, some sort of a manipulating situation that was going on. The A Pisces cancer scorpion was trying to manipulate a situation. Mercury. So there is going to be fast communication. Mercury, the fast moving planet so of speed and communication is here. And that is the energy of the magician. So um, the energy of Mercury is coming in and it's going to be taking down this um, um, Pisces cancer or scorpion man because they recognize this man play. This man is scorpion. It's a, it can be for some of you a Pisces cancer or scorpion person, but for most of you, it's going to be a scorpion manager and they're going to be taking down this person. And I see a lot of you Tauruses are going to be regaining a new stability um, in this month because they recognize what this um, Pisces cancer or scorpion person. Some of you is a cancer, some of you is a scorpion, okay? So this is a really, really wonderful alignment of energies, especially for manager, supervisor. I see you are going to be getting, because Uranus is in the third, is, is in the end of the cross. Uranus, the energy of the fool is Uranus. And when Uranus comes in, um, first you have the magician that was fast communication um, with, a, the, with a sort of truth coming down on a Pisces cancer, a scorpion man. And then we have you, Tauruses, is going to be getting a lead way because you, Tauruses, are going to be freed from some sort of a conventional situation that a Pisces Cancer Scorpion Man was doing. And you're going to be getting the lead way. So Uranus is coming in at the end of this cross. And Uranus is about the sidewalking of the rebellion and the resolution. So you or going to be resolving some sort of a situation, an issue and problem that a manager or supervisor have created or some sort of a business partner who have created a whole lot of issues and problems. So, so this is wonderful. Let's look at each individual week. The first week, you're going to be using um, information. You're going to be communicating very clear and going to be saying to this manager, this stockbroker or um, this person, whoever this person is like, hey, listen, you have to you have to reorganize here and you have to recognize what is happening and transpire. You are definitely using the sword of truth in a wrong um, way. Um, and you have been creating a whole lot of issue. And I see you guys, you Tauruses are going to be standing your ground and recognizing the foul play of this man and I see you Taurus is, is going to be getting help from a Gemini and showing up this man and the foul play what this man has been doing. In the second week I see a lot of you recognize um, who your enemy is and who has been working and standing in your way and this is a cancer man or a scorpion man and I see that you Taurus is, is going to be using the, suit, uh, the sword of truth to get up with a Gemini and it's going to be recognizing what this man has done and it's going to be collaborating in order to communicate and let people know what this man was doing and how this man has been creating some sort of um, issues. Uranus, which is good, where an Aquarian could be coming in and helping out 
you guys okay so this is good um taurus is no matter what is happening what is transpiring it's going to be good because in the third week uh, um you are going to be released uranus uh, um is going to be releasing you if you're a lawyer you are going to be released from a situation because you are going to be recognizing and it's going to be giving up a scorpion man and a cancer man that they are the one that had uh, asked you to um, create some sort of a document or to start something or to create something. And you're going to be saying, hey, these are the two um, businessmen that came to me um, and asked me to create this document and the situation. And a lot of you are going to be really getting this new start because you and your reputation have uh, been hurt especially if you're a lawyer because you're going to be recognizing that a scorpion man and a cancer man has been co coordinating and cohooting together in order to create some sort of a situation and got you to create some sort of a documentation and data and information that was on false ground and i see that they're going to be releasing you tauruses because you tauruses went back and researched the situation and recognized that these people had asked you to do something on the false pretend where you come into some sort of a problem with manager and people higher ups and you're going to be taken down the cancer and the scorpion because you recognize who the cancer and the scorpion is and what the cancer and the scorpion has done in order to get you involved in some sort of a situation okay so it is going to be really really positive as we look at the fourth week we have the energy of judgment now the fourth week um and with the energy of judgment this is about pluto so you have Uranus and Pluto, but Uranus is actually helping you guys to give you a new start. But Pluto is coming in in order to show up um, some sort of a um, dishonest play with these managers and these businessmen. And um, I am calling of forgiveness and releasing yourself from this group of businessmen or from this um, problem with these business people or your associates because this is coming up as associate business people stock brokers um stock people who work um working in alignment of energies and i've got you taurus uh, in some sort of a situation and i see you taurus this is going to be um using the sword of truth and standing your ground and showing up uh, the, the scorpion man and the cancer man for what they have been doing and co-oxing together and with that, in the fourth week, uh, you're going to be bringing down and releasing yourself from these people because you recognize that these people have been moving in a direction where they were just thinking about themselves. They were basically just thinking about themselves and uh, um, was not protecting the customers or was not protecting um, the workers, the co-workers, the colleagues. Um, was not um, uh, protecting their employees and I see if you are a lawyer you're going to be coming down really really hard on this company um, because you recognize that this company has not been doing their job so I see lawyers doctors civil servants are really going to be coming down on um, a cancer man and a scorpion man because they recognize the connection and the collaboration of a cancer man and a scorpion man and how they have uh, gotten some of you Tauruses to make and do something that was not above water and you are coming in in this um, timeline trying to resolve the situation and you're going to be recognizing at the end of the month there's no love there is because these people are going to be uh, recognizing that you are not on their team so you're not going to be receiving any love or appreciation for what you have been doing but i see you taurus is going to say you know you know to hell with it i'm going to be making this right and i'm going to be um righting the wrongs that i have done and you tauruses are going to be really um taking the rain and making the rights wrong so i see a lot of business people a lot of man people in management position is really going to be having it out. It's going to be recognizing how you got connected with a group of businessmen that was very disturbing. This group of businessmen recognize uh, 
um, some sort of an honor fair game and situation that was happening and transpiring. And these businessmen are going to be recognizing how you um, clear up a situation that they have gotten you in. So a lot of you um, are going to be recognizing, hey, I am not going to be breaking the law for no one. I am going to be making things right. It is unfair, some sort of an unfair game that was played. And a lot of you are going to be deciding, no, 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 I'm making this thing right, whatever it is and how long it takes. I'm going to make this thing right because we need to um, make the right decision for the employees. Okay. So you end the month. Um, with the situation where the element of uh, the power of water, where people, you know, could be against you, but you're like, uh, you know, it's okay because I'm going to make this thing right. I'm going to be healing whatever this problem is and this situation. So, you know, you don't have to be on my team because I'm not going to be on your team where um, you're asking me or you have asked me to break the law in the past. I'm not going to be doing that. I'm going to be doing the right thing and correct what has happened and what has transpired. I'm going to be making sure that I correct the situation. Okay. So a lot of you are going to be having a whole lot of problems and issues. Um, that, um, it could have been something that you have done in the past. So, but in order to correct this, you're going to be making it right because you have the energy of the magician and you have all of the elements and all of the tools that you need in order to correct something that a Cancer and a Scorpion has done. And I see um, whoever this person is, you Tauruses are going to be coming out on top because I see Uranus, uh, you have the energy of Uranus is going to be moving and leaving these people behind uh, because you recognize that these uh, businessmen have brought you in some sort of a situation. A lot of you are going to be having the support of a Gemini. Whoever this Gemini is, uh, and this Gemini is going to be coming in and supporting a lot of you um, moving on your journeys forward. This Gemini is going to be recognizing that and a lot of you was being worked against by these two men, the Scorpion and the Spices, and their secrets is going to be coming out and people are going to be recognizing what they have done. Okay, so it is um, really wonderful. It's really uh, positive. Um, uh, please show your loves by thumbs up. I'm going to be moving forward. I would love to see you on the other side. If not, I am going to be saying namaste to a lot of you. And I will speak to you next month. If you want to see the extended of this reading, it's a dollar ninety nine per month. Use the extended, the blue link to join. And there you can see the extended. I gotta go. I show your loves by thumbs up. Namaste.